up to the rescheduled elections, the Nigerian army says it will obey orders from constituted authority. Also, the army says it will deal decisively with electoral offenders, echoing on the statement by President Buhari on ballot box snatches. The Nigerian army is committed to deal severely with offenders, saying the unity of Nigeria remains paramount, just as it directed its unit commanders to ensure a peaceful atmosphere during the conduct of the polls. It remains a political to ensure that no negative aspiration is cast on the Nigerian army before, during, or after the elections. It is unfortunate to hear persons who are aspiring to rule this country again, inciting the army to disobedience. We have consistently stated our position in the political dispensation to remain neutral and apolitical. The Chief of Army staff also said the force remains committed to defending the territorial integrity of Nigeria, just as he directed the escort attacks to politicians and retired military officers be withdrawn till after the elections. Commanders must deal decisively with any electoral crime or action that will be inimical to national security. Commanders are to ensure that they and their personnel do not hobnob with politicians at any level. In this regard, there will be no military escort for any politician, and all Nigerian Army personnel are to stay clear of retired military officers, especially those who are now, uh, who are now politicians. The Army maintains that it will stick to the tenets of professionalism, adding that wrongful incitement will not be tolerated and that it will remain neutral and discharge its duties according to the law. In Abuja, Oluwato Bianeton reporting for Rus TV, Nigeria.